don't look now, but there's something funny going on over there at the bank, George. I've never really seen one, but that's got all the earmarks of being a run. Hello, it's Black Monday, September 29th, 2008. I'm John Pachkowski, and this is Digital Daily. Let's see, how can I put this delicately? Well, the stock market's in the toilet. Technology stocks slipped further into the murky depths today after the financial bailout package failed to pass at the U.S. House of Representatives. The Dow Jones Industrial Average plunged 700 points and is fast approaching its biggest point loss ever. The Nasdaq tumbled 142 points with losses in the tech sector led by Apple, whose shares fell more than 17% to $105. That's their lowest level in more than a year. Yahoo, HP, IBM, Microsoft, and Oracle are all down as well. Ugly times. Truly ugly times. Just remember that this thing isn't as black as it appeared. Well, the financial turmoil beating the United States economy into submission has finally begun to beat Google, the great and powerful, down as well which must come as something of a shock to CEO Eric Schmidt, who earlier this month claimed the financial meltdown was unlikely to affect Google at all. My guess is the drama is in New York, not here, Schmidt said at the company's Zeitgeist conference. It's business as usual at Google. As a company, we're fine. Well, allow me to be the first to say, bull Schmidt. Google's share price plummeted in trading today, along with most other tech stocks. It fell to a 52-week low of $406 and then slipped below $400. That's a price range the company's not seen since September of 2006, and it's furlongs away from the company's 52-week high of $747. So if that's business as usual at Google, then Steve Ballmer is Sergey Brin's father. Larry Page is too. Yeah, the drama is all in New York. It's probably just psychological, right? We've got a problem. Yes, you do. That's it for Digital Daily. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again tomorrow.